The ambassador said that Europe's creative approach would aid Namibia in eradicating poverty. We are here to take a creative approach how to support four principles and how to support eradication of poverty, inclusion of Namibia in the world economy, and of course, the sustainable growth. Furthermore, Hibaskova was pleased that Namibia would be hosting a meeting between African, Caribbean and Pacific members of parliament on an economic discussion with the European Union in June. We are very happy having Namibia as a strategic venue of a very strategic discussion which will happen in the mid of June, which is joint parliamentary assembly of African, Caribbean, Pacific and European Union members of parliaments. More than 300 members of parliaments will gather in Windhoek for strategic discussion on post Cotonou agreement. The event was kept off by a toast by Hibaskova and Deputy Minister of International Relations and Cooperation, Peya Mushelenga, in which they wished President Hage Gengop future health and success. The EU has commended President Hage Gengop and the Namibian government for launching the Harambe Prosperity Plan. Reporting for the News on One, I'm Adolf Kaure.